children, today we are going to have fun with water and we are going to learn about air pressure and vacuum with this pressure fountain experiment. And for this pressure fountain experiment, we need an old plastic bottle, a piece of straw and a paper cutter or you can use a nail and a hammer to make a hole in this plastic bottle. Make sure you work it near the sink. Today I am having a bowl and a jar of water. Now let's take the sharp knife or paper cutter like this. Make sure you be careful with the sharp objects. Now we are going to make a hole on this plastic bottle. Now I made a hole and the hole should be exactly in the shape of uh, the straw and we are going to insert the straw inside that hole. Now open the lid and pour some water. Watch it closely. Now where's the water? Why isn't it coming out of the straw? Shouldn't gravity be acting upon the water? Let's talk about air pressure and vacuum. Air pressure is a strong force. It is the force exerted on a surface by the air above it as gravity pulls it to earth. The weight of all this air is known as air pressure. The more air that is above us, the higher the air pressure will be. At greater heights, the air pressure is lower because there is less air above weighing down. So basically, high pressure moves to low pressure. That means more air moves to less air. And what is vacuum? A vacuum is a space with nothing in it, not even air. A vacuum is a place where there is no air. So, when there is no air, the air will rush into that empty space to fill that. When we cover up the lid to the bottle, now I am closing it as it has already the hole in it. I am closing it with my finger. The water is pulling down but the air up in the top of the bottle is becoming a vacuum. That means air pressure outside the bottle is higher. So, it actually tries to push into the bottle through the bottom hole. So the water is kept in. Now when you observe, when the lid is released on the top, there is no vacuum. So the water is free to flow out of this hole. So children, did you all enjoy this pressure fountain experiment with this boy? Let's keep learning science with Mary Mopitskill. Meet you all with another experiment. Bye children!